Craig, a big day for you Saturday. Sam already in the Blue Diamond. Very impressive last time. Yeah, she's going really good, mate. She uh, She's trained on since her, her win. She won nice at Flemington first up and then come out here and was a good, good solid win and she's trained on, so I'm really looking forward to her. You rode her in her work this morning. Uh, take us through that. Yeah, she worked really good. She sort of worked half mile, strolled up a nice 600 and she did it all on the ride and ran some nice times, so she's, uh, she's taken natural improvement from the run and she'll be hard to beat. The way she hit the line must give you confidence too from that pro you. Yeah, absolutely. She um, she's very relaxed, mate, Philly, and I mean, if uh, if they go slow, she can she can race up on the speed. If they go quick, she can settle back off them. But um, look, she she's pretty foolproof. Uh, obviously, most two-year-old races coming into barriers a little bit, but um, if she can draw a nice marble. She's going to be the one to beat. She the best two-year-old you've ridden? In a race, yes. Um, I did a lot of work with Olingi as a as a baby, and obviously she's. We all know what she's done, but this filly's right up there with um, with the best of them. You also rode Princess Nareen coming off a second to speediness last time, and that form looks pretty good now. Yeah, the form's really good. Speediness come out and, and won good at Flemington. And this mare, she she come out here two starts ago at Caulfield and was a good, tough, determined win and just got rolled by him the other day. So um, another, another one, if she can draw a nice gate, she's going to get a good run and be hard to beat. And also Elite Falls and the Oakley Plate from the John O'Shea stable. Yeah, she's going really good. John's been very happy with her this preparation and I'll give her a nice solid jump out at Flemington last last Friday and she sort of sat a couple of links off the second last horse loop the field and finished with the leaders. So um, being an Oakley Plate, there's going to be a stack of speed. She's going to find herself probably midfield or a touch worse and she'll get on good. This stage, Sepoy's a favour for that race. What do you make of him? Yeah, he's obviously the, the benchmark. He's, he's unbeaten in Melbourne and... He's got a lump of, lump of fair weight, so hopefully he stays at home.